far. I mean, I'm also I barely pay attention to anything, so that right. I'm just confused as to what's. There happened. might have just been one. But it's episode. still funny or no? It was a couple episodes. Oh, interesting. It's still funny. They still got it. They yeah. got Towley. They got Tal. Towley is his business partner. Oh, hell, hell I yes. thought they were gonna make him join the Towley band. Oh, Tal, I'm high. That's dude, awesome. Great character, dude. dude what and then you? also, Mister Duke. What was the piece of shit's name? Uh, Mister Dukey, the Christmas poo. Mister Hanky. Mister Hanky. Mister Hanky, the Hanky Christmas poo. poo. Yeah. I love him, and he loves, he loves me. Yeah, he I think loves you. those characters were like yeah. originally like supposed to be ironic or some shit. I don't know, I but mean, I think they were perfect for children because I was that, third in fourth grade when that. Shit well, was Trey Parker, and Matt Stone. It. I think that that was all because that was like the first episode is Mister Hanky. That's the first episode of South Park. Yeah, it's early on, so that was like might have been they were they were one. probably both like probably thirteen and fourteen years old when they wrote that. Nice. Yeah, because the show's been on since they were in middle school. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They're actually around our age. They're about our age. <laughs> <laughs> it is wild how like I mean yeah season one episode nine you can check in that and that show and it's still good for a laugh here and there yeah I guess because it didn't have like the kind of precipitous decline that that uh, the Simpsons did the Family Guy well it's been the same guys the whole time it's been the same guys the whole time but it's just yeah it's impressive how much you know. There's there's like thirty seasons of that show, and I yeah. think they've been fairly immune to. Uh, uh, sorry to bring up this term, but uh, cancel culture. Well, it's because it's the only show that is worth the shit on, and that Viacom has it all. Yeah, yeah. I think, I think that yeah. they're really still allowed to go there. In respect to them. You yeah, and right. they actually do too, because the one episode I watched are just like shitting all over China. <laughs> I mean, it's not even like it's. Not, it's funny because you know you like you remember talking about like the the Chappelle thing, which I didn't watch and I barely know I what people are mad about. But like, you know, like if because the South Park has been consistent where they they are like you know I, I guess you call it a libertarian show to a mm-hmm. certain extent, but certainly about like caring about like free speech if you do within the context of comedy. It's like the the biggest threat really is the degree in which like companies are beholden to the fucking government of China now. I mean, it's the fucking the Marvel shit, the NBA shit is insane. Mm-hmm. I mean, that's like fucking From truly last year? wild. Daryl yeah. Morey? The yeah, most yeah, chilling yeah. thing I've seen in the last couple of years with regards to speech is just that John Cena video where him speaking fluent Mandarin for, and apologizing for saying that Taiwan was not a part of China. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, that's real? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, 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 information uh Wait, that's real? <laughs> yeah, you haven't seen that? No, I haven't. I thought Play. that was a joke. I saw John Cena on the show. I thought it was like a deep fake of somebody with John Cena's no, face. No, this is Chinese. real. That's real, dude. Oh, no, I did what? not know about this. Yeah. Does he know how to speak Chinese? I guess he they must. Had to, he, they had to fucking teach him it. Yeah, he had to fucking apologize for... Wow, that sucks. What is that? So sorry. Yeah, he's like, uh, Nihao, uh, you, you, you cannot see me at you.